Hello, I am Dr. Srikant Reddy. I am a consultant neurophysician practicing at Ashoda Hospital, Malakpet. Today, I am going to talk about Parkinson's disease. A Parkinson's disease is a neurodegenerative disorder. A, in a neurodegenerative disorder, the nerve cells which control our movements, they decline, they degenerate quite early. Because of the degeneration, the patients will be having different different symptoms. And how to uh, how do we diagnose or how do you uh, how do, how to recognize Parkinson's disease? The Parkinson's disease is recognized by a combination of any of these symptoms. Uh, it, it is recognized or it is suspected in a patient who is having stiffness of the limbs, that means hands and legs, or stiffness of the body, or if they are very slow to move very slow to talk or if their voice is very low or if their walking is very slow and they have a tendency to fall any of this combination of symptoms if they are there we suspect it is a parkinson's disease and because of the parkinson's disease even their hand signature their signature also changes the letters become small and small and their signature keeps on changing if a person is having any of these symptoms the doctor generally suspects a possibility of parkinson's disease then how to confirm Parkinson's disease? See, there are no confirmatory tests. A neurophysician examines the patient based on the given symptoms and our examination findings. We suspect and confirm the diagnosis of Parkinson's disease. And next thing is that, do we have any treatment for the Parkinson's disease? Yes, there are certain medication available to control the symptoms of Parkinson's disease. I'm emphasizing the term to control because there is no cure for Parkinson's disease. We have some medicines wherein we can give some symptomatic relief to the patient. By using those medicines, the patient's shaking, the tremors can be minimized and their, the speed of movement or their speed of movement of the limbs and gait, their walking also can be changed. And even we can improve their balancing ability, thereby we can reduce the falls. And how long this symptomatic treatment, how long the medication is to be continued? This symptomatic medication is to be continued for a longer period for many years. Like we use the medicines for your diabetes and high, high blood pressure, even for Parkinson's also patients, they have to continue medis medication under close uh, neurophysician follow-up and this has to be continued for many years. And third thing, do you have any other treatment modalities for the Parkinson's disease? Yes, there are some surgical options are also available. One such surgical option is called deep brain stimulation wherein we place some electrodes into the patient's brain and we keep a battery here. This keeps on stimulating certain parts of the brain at a desired frequency thereby the patient's symptoms of tremors, stiffness and other slow movements can be improved. But this surgery is considered only in certain patients after thorough evaluation by an experienced neurophysician who has an expertise in this Parkinson's disease as well as by a neurosurgeon who does this functional neurosurgery. Thank you.